Hello, my name is Olivia, and this is part one of a two-part, very short series on thymidine kinase 1. I'd like to introduce you to thymidine kinase 1, also known as TK1, as a mechanistic oncology biomarker of cell proliferation. Thymidine kinase 1 is an enzymatic protein involved with DNA synthesis, thus is a logical target to use as a biomarker for a disease of uncontrolled growth, such as cancer. Typically, TK1 is made in the S phase and is degraded when cells finish dividing. But in cancer, the cell cycle regulation is lost and TK1 levels are upregulated. There's lots of strong support for TK1 as an oncology biomarker. And in one study, TK1 is in the top 10 genes that when upregulated are associated with poor disease prognosis across 39 different malignancies in 18,000 tumors. In fact, TK1 increases early in a variety of cancers and correlates with things like tumor progression, recurrence, and can even correlate with a subject's early response to cancer therapy. Newer studies suggest that TK1 may also be expressed on the surface of cancer cells and has potential to serve as a target for anti-cancer therapy. While TK1 has usefulness alone, like any good biomarker, it also has the potential to be combined with other tumor markers to further increase diagnostic accuracy. And one of the most appealing characteristics of TK1 is its detection in serum and the fact that it can be used for a very broad range of malignancies, including liquid and solid tumors. So historically, TK1 or TK enzymatic activity has been the predominant way to measure TK1. And this measurement has been long used in a clinical setting for blood cancers. That being said, recent evidence shows that the behavior of the enzyme is actually pretty complex in malignancy. And that while inside the cell, TK1 exists as a tetramer, outside the cell, this 2015 paper shows that TK1 forms complexes of different molecular sizes in human serum. Those contain both active and inactive TK1 protein. Thus, total TK1 protein is a more accurate measurement to make. If you're interested in measuring TK1 for your oncology research, Dia Pharma would be happy to provide further information or address any questions you may have. Products to measure TK1, as well as a unique list of oncology markers, can be found at diapharma.com. Thanks for your attention, and if you want to hear about specific TK1 measuring ELISA kit, please listen to part two of the thymidine kinase saga. Have a great day.